29 March 2023, Kernville, California. Uh, in between the, this, this is like the first day of when it was supposed to rain, and it has rain, snow again, and we got a little bit more to come. But when I'm over here across from the rodeo grounds for is this right here. I haven't really done a video on this, I don't think. This is what is left of, I believe it was called Camp James. This is where, like, during the Whiskey Flat days, they come down in here and they set up camp. And this is where your horseback riders and the gunfight stuff will come from. But, look at this. Look at this, would you? There's a little bit of one of their corrals left over there. But other than that... I'm not seeing much down through here at all. Maybe over that way just a little bit. Yeah, look at the debris piled up there underneath some trees. Look at that. And then off, off over there. More big time debris. Now, I'm not going to get off very far in here. These old boys are working down in here, and they're probably not wanting me around here. So, there you go. And I'm going to back off out of here, get out of their work zone. And uh, yeah, there you go. 29 March 2023, still at the same spot here, but I moved up out of there because they're getting ready to do some cutting and they were looking at me and you know, I mean, come on. They don't have to tell me to leave, I know better. Let's walk around here a little, just along this road a wee tiny bit. And you can see just how devastated this area really is. Um, I did not come up through here when the flood was happening because there was really no point. This road was closed down here around the corner. The water was up onto this road. Look at that. They've still got a pit. Probably a barbecue pit, but it looks like it may be. So that's still left over there. You can see just how fast this water ran by the gouges it dug all off down through here. Trees all ran over. It was a live tree. It simply got uprooted. Wow. You know what, I'm going to go ahead and pause this, get back in my car, go up to that corner and film some more. So hang on, I'll be right back. Let's do this. Oh, there it is. Went over 10 miles an hour. Well, it's going to keep doing that, and it is. We'll just jump right on up here to the corner. Look at that. Just gone. All of their sand and everything is just gone. One of their walkways that used to go down to ground. Now it's rocks. That's ground, but it's rocks. Wow, look at all that. Okay. I'm tired of this ding, 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 and the crap. Okay, this right here, this corner, yeah, it was flooded. When I came down through here, when I was actually able to get through here, and I didn't do a video, I didn't do a video because I needed to just get through here. Look at this. Anybody who knows what this used to look like knows that this is nothing what it used to look like. There is just... I mean, I'm going to just say it. Just trillions of tons of sand that has been misplaced. This thing right here, this corner, 
where the river comes it comes down back there and then it hangs this sharp turn well this road had water coming out of that corner down there and came all the way up touched up into their fences here before it went back down into here and that was evident by the uh, uh, whiskey flat encampment there you go Look at how big. <laughs> wow. Whiskey, whiskey flat boulders. It's a lot of work that needs to be done here to get it back. Again, look at all of the debris piled up in the trees. I don't know if you can hear those backup buzzers. They're busy. Working away on the other side of the park over there, moving sand back where it needs to be.